So for some reason unknown to me or anybody really, I don't think Jake even knows, I've asked him. Riley is all of a sudden have this obsession with sausage out of nowhere. Why, why are you obsessed with sausage all of a sudden? Because I like it. But you never had it. I don't know. She does. She doesn't eat meat. She's never really eaten meat. She's kind of like me. I'm vegetarian. She doesn't. She just doesn't eat meat very often. I don't think. I mean, she's tried a couple of things, but doesn't really. I don't know. But all of a sudden, I don't know where. Like two weeks ago, she's been obsessed with sausage, and she's like, "I really want sausage." Because I'm like, "Why do you want sausage?" Because I love sausage. So. Yesterday at the grocery store, I picked her up some Morningstar sausage. It's the maple flavored one. And I'm going to give it to her today. I cooked it up and I've got eggs and sausage and a piece of toast. And that's going to be her breakfast this morning. And we'll see if she actually likes sausage as much as she thinks she does. I don't know. You ready to try it? Yeah. Yeah? All right. This is a lovely big sissy. Is that the toy you decided to give him? Look at how he looks at you. He loves you. Yeah. Alright. There's your breakfast. You gonna try your sausage? All right, go ahead. Moment of truth. Mm. What do you think? You like it? She always says that. Let's see if she actually eats all of it. Do you actually like it? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> Riley, what are you doing? Why are you all the way over there? Did she say she's relaxing? This weather has been so bipolar. This morning I came out, it was warm. And then I came out again later and there was like a wet spot over here. Like it, oh, you can kind of see it with the hula hoop. It had rained, but it was warm again. And then I went back inside and I get like 10 minutes later I got a notification. It said 90% chance of participation in 10 minutes. It rained again. And now it's like perfect outside. We've gone through like seven seasons in the course of a day. Half a day. Hi, baby. I gotta go get the wind check. Look how cute you is. Oh, your big sissy's a weirdo. I know. You're a jerk. I know. <laughs> uh, okay, so I just got done with my workout and I'm about to make um, some sort of, it's called Caribbean bowl with jerk cauliflower steak. So, I don't know, it's the seasoning called jerk seasoning. Apparently it's a Jamaican thing. I don't know, it took like six hours to find in the grocery store because they rearranged, they rearranged everything like a month ago and I still have yet to figure out where everything goes. Um, and this wasn't with like the normal seasoning. It was down like the international aisle. I don't know, it took forever. But anyway, I got done working out. I'm all sweaty and gross and disgusting. And I'm gonna do. I'm gonna attempt to make this. It looks really good. Let's see if I can get a good picture. It looks really, really good. But yeah, you can have some jello. Remember that? No, let's go to Jeanette. Here you go. No, we're not gonna put goldfish in jello. Yeah, see, are you? Oh, you're talking about Swedish fish? Yeah. That's for blue jello. So it looks like a uh, swimming bowl. Anyway, so yeah, this is what I'm gonna make today. Because I'm trying to be healthy. as cute as it does on 
their little recipe thing, but it's still pretty good. I'm really excited about the salsa thing. Is it really a salsa? I don't know, but it looks good. Yummy. The jerk spice is kind of spicy. All right, you ready? Yeah. Riley's been begging to do this all day. Get her tattoos, too. Tomorrow is her little friend. She has a neighborhood friend who they play with like every day, actually around this time of day when Jake leaves. They play every day together, her and these two other little girls. And um, her birthday is tomorrow. Today is not really her birthday, but we're gonna give her her birthday gift today because she said that she's probably not gonna see you tomorrow because I think she's gonna go do something with her family. So, this is what we ended up buying the other day. We did end up getting the um, the bracelets and the tutti, or the not the tutti frutti one, the piece of cake slime. And then Riley found these Jojo Siwa tattoos because she likes Jojo Siwa too, huh? Yeah. Yeah. And so now we're going to wrap up her present with her beautiful butterfly wrapping paper that you bought. Right? All right, let's do it. Correct. Correct. You're crazy. the big present but we'll just hand that to her and if anyone asks you wrap this and I had no part in helping because my wrapping job looks just as good as your wrapping job probably would so we'll just lie if anyone asks you wrap this all on your own yeah okay <laughs> Oh, you pussy. Yeah? Can you turn off the fan for baby brother so he doesn't get cold? Okay, I, I will help you get dressed. I'll help you get very dressed. Aww. Don't cry. Baby massages feel so good. A foot massage. A baby massage. Arm massage. Nothing. All right, you ready for your pajamas? I'm gonna put these on. You got little bears on them. Little bears? No. Look at big sissy. Oh, thank you for helping, Riley. Be careful. He likes to grab your face. He's been doing that to mommy. He grabs my face and he just pulls on it. Yeah, kind of like that. Mom can do it to me. I think he's just, oh, he tooted. <laughs> I heard that too. Oh, big sissy said you could pull on her face like you do me. It kind of hurts a little bit though. Be careful. If it hurts too bad, just pull him away, okay? Okay. Wow, so, okay, I just got, it's like 10.30 and I just got like both the kids down to sleep both asleep and I dress now and getting started on my dinner that's been literally sitting on top of the stove for like the past three hours I did a little cleaning up picked up the living room a little bit oh look <laughs> I have my little workout station over here so I have like booty bands and weights and then the other day I got Riley her little own set of two pound dumbbells and she loves doing her workouts with me it's so freaking cute but yeah, I'm cleaning up this little area over here. looks like a complete disaster, and I don't really know what to do with it. So that's like baby brother's stuff. That basket, I, I don't know what I'm going to do with That was from um, Jake's mom. I don't know, maybe I'll send it back home with her later. But underneath that is um, Jimmy's, the bottom of Jimmy's cage and his perch things. And then there's all like the toys and stuff that he had in his cage. And I don't know what to do with all of it. <laughs> it's just been sitting here. I mean, he passed away in January, right before I had baby brother. And I don't know what to do with it <clears throat> because I don't, 
I don't want to throw it away because I feel like, I don't know, I just can't bring myself to go just toss it in the dumpster. And I don't, I've just been holding on to it, but I know realistically I shouldn't hold on to it either because we're not gonna get a bird, another bird anytime soon. So, I don't know. And it's like, it's been hit, it was his cage for a really long time. I had him for like six years. So the cage is definitely worn and loved. So I don't know, I can't like really donate it to anywhere either. Cause like I said, it's like, it's clean, but it's not like, it's dirty just cause it's old. Like it's worn, I guess is more the right description of it. So I don't know what to do. It has the, my bird's name was Jimmy. It has the vote for Jimmy st uh, sticker on it and everything. And I just, I don't know what to do with it. I can't bring myself to go take it to the dumpster and throw it away. Just the thought of doing that just like breaks my heart. Like what do you do with like dead pets belongings? Like when a dog dies, like what do you do with like their leash and their dog bowl and everything? Do people just throw away that kind of thing? I don't really know what to do with it and it's just been sitting here and it kind of depresses me because I look at it every day and it just, it's not, you know, it's not attractive either. <laughs> just sitting there, it takes up a lot of space and but I just don't know what to do with it. But yeah, anyway, both the kids are asleep and um, tomorrow we have gymnastics and stuff and I think I want to record another vlog tomorrow because I don't know why. I like doing these. Um, but yeah. <laughs>